we invited 23 cars from 21 automakers. Everything from luxury sedans to hot hatches, crossovers to supercars, even a minivan and an EV. As usual, there were no price caps, no categories, and no nonsense. Any new or significantly revised new car that piqued our interest got the nod. Our mission was simple. Put the assembled field of hopefuls to the test over four days of nonstop rigor, then shave down the list until only the best of the best, the 2017 Automobile All-Stars, remained. When you're evaluating the world's top cars, some wisdom is only attainable at unrestricted speeds. So this year we invaded Speed Vegas, Sin City's newest playpen just 15 miles south of the Strip for some on-track evaluation. At the flashy 1.5 mile, 12 turn road course, we took the measure of the year's hottest track rats. Speed Vegas proved right at home for contenders like the Nissan GTR Nismo, with Godzilla devouring corner after corner as it has for nearly a decade. Supercars like the New Age Acura NSX and the dashing Aston Martin DB11 offered up thrills of their own. A blur of smoke blue and the squeal of hot tires meant the Ford Focus RS was drifting through yet another turn. Porsche's 718 Cayman and BMW's M2 also stood out in Speed Vegas, as did Honda's Civic Hatchback Sport, which made a case for the most fun per dollar at just over 22 grand. But the track attack was just one part of the week's All-Stars evaluation. High above the strips, glitzy din is Nevada's Mount Charleston, featuring a glorious stretch of State Route 158 that crests at more than 8,400 feet. It's one of the region's loveliest driving roads with twists, turns, and constant elevation changes that make for one hell of a challenge for any car. Save for a little melted snow and scattered salt on the shoulder, the 8.8 mile pass stayed squeaky clean. Soon we tackled Mount Charleston with confidence, careful to maintain balance and composure through some of the faster sections and blind turns. Our fleet of largely forced induction engines boosted their way up and down the mountain, while the natural breathing Toyota Prius Prime, Cadillac XT5, and Chrysler Pacifica needed a Perrier. The upstart G90 looked to make a name for itself in Korean engineering, while the Lincoln Continental chased its long-lost luster. At the route's summit, the temperature dipped to a frosty 25 degrees, so we were thankful we opted for the less aggressive tire options. As the pale desert sun began to set on the final day of evaluation, we tallied the votes and six winners rose to stake their claim. BMW M2, the Acura NSX, the Chevrolet Bolt EV, the Porsche 718 Cayman S, the Volvo S90, and the Honda Civic Hatchback Sport. For all of their differences, hailing from four countries motivated by vastly different powertrains and serving customers all over the automotive spectrum, the 2017 Automobile All-Stars have it in spade where it counts. We admire them, we want them, and we didn't want to give them back.